The 10 News Weather Authority, always watching and tracking for you from the JES Weather Center. Good evening, friends. Check in on Skycam Network tonight, showing temperatures. One temperature there starting with a 4, 48 degrees in Withville. We're finally getting a little bit of a taste of fall. 53 right now in Martinsville, 61 in Roanoke, and 56 degrees right now in Blacksburg, along with clear conditions. Temperatures elsewhere sitting at 52 in Hot Springs, 53 in Covington, 60 in Bedford, 53 in Lexington, 61 in Lynchburg, and sitting at 51 degrees in Floyd as well. So we are finally beginning to see a little bit more of a fall like pattern, and this will stick around for quite a while. These next couple of mornings, certainly going to need any sort of jacket, hoodies, or headed out the door. For the next few hours, we will fall into the 50s, sitting at 53 by 4 o'clock, and in the morning hours, warming up to 64 degrees by noontime. So even by lunch, we're still pretty mild back in the 60s. Now, a quick refresh. Our average for this time of year is 73 degrees, and actually for the majority of this work week, we're pretty below average temperature-wise with a lot of sunshine to go along with it. Although we're staying calm here locally, there is a big weather maker to talk about. Hurricane Milton that is now a Category 5 and headed right towards the west coast of Florida. Right now, those wind speeds, the sustained maximum wind speed is right at a 165 miles an hour. This is still moving towards the east about 9 to 10 miles an hour. And this is a concern. You'll notice the track has shifted just a little bit further northward in this last update we received about 10 o'clock. This is still projected to make landfall as a Category 3 hurricane still on that west coast where they are still recovering from Helene. Already saturated ground, debris that still needs cleanup in that area. Cannot stress enough if you are in that evacuation zone in the west coast of Florida. Now is the time to take action. This is expected to make landfall Wednesday in the afternoon and evening hours. But a little bit closer to home, we're not going to be seeing any impacts from Milton because of this center of high pressure right here. This is creating sort of a dome like effect over our area, and that is why all the tropical activity will stay further towards the south. We had a cold front that moved through and high pressure that will continue to build in behind it, and that will be the story throughout the entirety of our work week. A lot of sunshine, a lot of blue sky, a drop in humidity, which will be very nice, and finally, temperatures that are much more seasonable into the 70s. And this broader picture, another great example of exactly how this high pressure is keeping the tropical system at bay, that is still keeping all of the Milton activity further into the southeast here in central and southwestern Virginia. We will not be affected because of that high pressure that is keeping all of that at bay. So we're keeping things clear tonight with low temperatures in the 40s and 50s, 49 degrees or low this evening in Roanoke. Next seven days, a lot of sunshine, basically a copy and paste forecast, 72 degrees or high temperature on Tuesday, 60s and 70s for the work week.